What's up, Cougars? My name is Casey Sorensen. I'm a California native from the Bay Area up north. I'm an English major and an environmental science minor, and my career aspirations are in flux, although I'm currently working as a project director uh, for a nonprofit up in Salt Lake. My favorite hobby right now, I would say, is woodworking. I would show you the fruits of my efforts. However, there are none because when I say new, I mean I started like three weeks ago and I'm barely learning the basics. But check back with me in three weeks and I'm sure to be a master. I wanted to be an English major because I wanted to be a doctor and I thought an English major would be helpful in, in teaching me how to communicate well with patients. I learned a lot as an English major and one thing I learned is I didn't want to be a doctor. I love my major because it's given me an opportunity to dig deep into the questions that keep me up at night. And it's taught me the skills I need to navigate those questions, to find experts and what they say about it, to find differing opinions and to figure out by comparing these different opinions what I think and, and where I land on the subject. One thing I've learned is that I don't really think I have a dream career. I have the things that are really important to me. I have the values that I hold really dear, the principles that I follow really closely. And that can kind of fit into a bunch of different categories. What I've learned through the humanities is an ability to navigate that and to be able to recognize that paths can change and that's totally normal. It's totally fine and it's actually kind of exciting. So I have two things here. The first thing is that I wish I knew like to the bottom of my soul that no matter who you are, what, no matter where you come from, no matter your political affiliation, your gender identity, your sexual orientation, there is a lot of people who have a lot of love, who want to support you and who want to bolster you through what is a really challenging academic experience. There is absolutely space for you here. The second thing I wish I knew is to not be afraid of professors. I learned too late how important and how valuable some of these relationships can be. It can be a mentoring relationship. It can be one where they impart just basic wisdom that they've learned over the years, whether academic, professional, personal. I wish I had knocked on their doors earlier and I would encourage you both to do that, to talk with them about, you know, the different questions that weigh on you and then to ask them which are the professors they recommend taking classes from? Some of my best uh, experiences as an undergrad have been from taking classes from other professors that I've really enjoyed and respect. That's it for today. Thanks for listening and go Cougs!